Hello everybody. Uh, I really didn't want to make this video, but with everything that's going on in the world right now, with this upcoming election being so pivotal, uh, not only for this country, but for the entire world, I just couldn't stay silent much longer. Um, a couple years ago, I was on a flight uh, from Detroit to New York City, uh, sitting in first class, thought I'd splurge. And uh, an older woman came and sat down next to me. Um, she introduced herself, asked if I knew who she was, told her she looked familiar. Um, I thought it was uh, Ellen DeGeneres, but it actually it turned out that she introduced herself as Hillary Rodham Clinton. <clears throat> I told her I had heard about her, and I wasn't really a fan, but I was very cordial to her and, and uh, didn't let my political views stand in the way of our conversation. Um, after the seatbelt light had turned off, she opened up a laptop, asked me if I knew how to uh, delete emails or bleach her hard drive. And I told her, yes, you know, you just click on here, hit empty trash, everything else. Um, later on the flight, she asked if uh, she could delete my hard drive or dispose of any trash that I have on my hard drive. And I kind of looked at her funny because I didn't have a laptop on me. I was just listening to music on my iPhone. Um, when I asked what she meant, she immediately put her hand between my legs. Um, at this time, I told her to stop. But when I glanced over, um, I could see through her pantsuits that she was aroused because uh, her penis was definitely uh, standing straight up. At that time, I, I, I called for the flight attendant. Uh, she walked over. I asked if I could move my seat or if Hillary could be moved. And the flight attendant told me that uh, if I had any... If I wanted to live, I should keep my mouth shut. So... I didn't say anything until now. Right now, I'm, I'm at an undisclosed hotel. Uh, in hiding, because I fear for my life. And the things that she said, the, the comments that she made about my my looks and the where she touched me is just ridiculous. She needs to be stopped. And I've never felt so hurt my whole entire life. I'm sorry. <laughs> 